today has got to go down as one of the best days of my life. We launched nice and early again out of the Port St. John's River mouth and we found these huge flocks of Cape Gannets. We dive down after these birds just to see how far they are going and at about 15 meters we came across a really really nice bait ball. Definitely the best of the season so far and uh, all the predators were there. Lots of sharks, lots of dolphins. Unfortunately the visibility wasn't that great, it was about 6 to 8 meters, so pretty dark down there. One predator was missing, the Brideswell. One of these guys was slowly making its presence up to the, up to the action. And it was in this rush of activity that for the first time I saw one of these massive big animals lunge at just the corner of this little bait ball. Eight years ago this was unheard of, undocumented and here today we had four or five rides well swimming around this one bait ball and just lunging through it every sort of four or five minutes. It's not often that all the variables come together. All the animals, the bait balls, the birds, the dolphins, the sharks, the whales. When it does, it's just one of those absolutely amazing experiences to be in the water. A really big whale, they get up to about 13 to 15 meters and 30 tons, so an animal that really needs a lot of sardines to keep him going. What was quite interesting to note is how these brides whales were feeding, sort of picking on the sides, just taking little bites as they would come through. What was quite interesting to see as well was how the, the dolphins were trying to keep this whole bait ball up on the surface. They would spend quite a bit of time pushing it up to the surface. Once it got up to about 8 or 10 meters, the birds would just plunge into the water, obviously scaring the sardines again and they would shoot back down to the bottom. So at last we've started seeing some really good signs of sardines. Big pockets now are starting to move through our area. Hopefully with that big swell starting to drop over the next couple of days we should have a good week ahead of us. At one stage we got a bit close and uh, we had quite a few near passes by the whale. was a bit too close for me unfortunately. 
decided that time was up. Um, I was going to head up to the surface, but there was one more pass, and quite incredibly, this big browsewell almost got a shark in its mouth. So I thank my lucky stars and I got out of there.